Hi, can you believe that the original Battlestar Galactica was released 45 years ago? Many of us grew up attached to the TV screens. I think it would be fun if you and your family sat on the couch and watched this movie again with the entire cast of then and now. Where are these actors now? Who made it to Hollywood and who passed away? Find the answer in our video. Lorne Green was born on February 12, 1915 in Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. He portrayed the character Adama in the TV series when he was 63 years old in 1978. We regret to inform you that in 1987, he passed away at the age of 72, leaving us deeply saddened. They want peace. Forgive me, Mr. President. But they hate us with every fiber of their existence. We love freedom. We love independence. To be accurate, the responsibility is to be truthful. Uh, the responsibility is not to mislead the view. John Kalikas was born on December 10, 1928, in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. He portrayed the character Count Baltar in the TV series when he was 50 years old in 1978. We regret to inform you that in 2000, he passed away at the age of 71, leaving us deeply saddened. The Spectre seems to have done rather well for an early model. Hmm. the best, I think. The script itself was, was absolutely fabulous because in a sense it was the United States and Russia carried, projected into the future. Sarah Rush was born on September 20th, 1955 in Winsburg, Pennsylvania, USA. She played the character Rico in the TV series when she was 23 years old in 1978. She is now living happily at the age of 67. Request permission to land. Permission granted. Core systems transferring control to probe craft. Launch when ready. No problem. So, how was it like to be on Battlestar Galactica? Oh, it was fantastic. Are you kidding me? You know what? I hate Dirk Benedict was born on March 1st, 1945, in Helena, Montana, USA. He played the character Lieutenant Starbuck in the TV series when he was 33 years old in 1978. He is now living happily at the age of 78. Hi, Starbuck. Boomer. Hiya, kid. Checking up on your grand, uh, commander? Nope. Dad's on patrol. He told me to wait up for him. And older girls liked us. Moms liked to watch us. Because we were guys. And women like to watch guys. I'm sorry. I know that's kind of a sexist statement, but they like, it's kind of... It was Noah Hathaway was born on November 13, 1971, in Los Angeles, California, USA. He portrayed the character Boxy in the TV series when he was 7 years old in 1978. He is now living happily at the age of 51. Can I, Grandpa? Yes, you may, of course, if that's what your father wanted. Oh, yes, he did. Oh, boy, I get to spend the night with the Blue Squad. And this, I'm doing that, so sometimes people help me. I don't know if it's helped or hurt. I mean, in a lot of ways, it's just opened up the doors to this whole new, I mean, you know, everybody. Richard Hatch was born on May 21st, 1945, in Santa Monica, California, USA. He portrayed the character Captain Apollo in the TV series when he was 33 years old in 1978. We regret to inform you that in 2017, he passed away at the age of 71, leaving us deeply saddened. Well, if you don't know, then there aren't any around. Be thankful for that. What are you afraid of? Please, just do as I say. My suggestion to you is to cut it down to a trailer. And so he took me over to Dreamscape, and uh, they did the, some of the um, modeling for the... Laura Spang was born on May 16, 1951, in Buffalo, New York, USA. She portrayed the character Cassiopeia in the TV series when she was 27 years old in 1978. She is now living happily at the age of 72. Getting ready to launch. Well, that's what I want to talk to you about. I know about the jump. Where are they sending Kane? I'm getting ready to jump into an inferno, and you want to talk to me about Kane? He isn't. Oh, you're doing it again, John. Hey. Hi, what are you doing about this thing? Well, nice to Herbert Jefferson Jr. was born on September 28, 1946, in Sandersville, Georgia, USA. 
He played the character Lieutenant Boomer in the TV series when he was 32 years old in 1978. He is currently living happily at the age of 76. Fruit juices, fruit juices, and uh, talk shop, and maybe even a couple of hands of pyramid. Uh, the storylines in the new one are there are those who just can't accept uh, the fact that it's no longer a true family show anymore. It's more of a Anne Lockhart was born on September 6, 1953, in New York City, USA. She played the character Lieutenant Sheba in the TV series when she was 25 years old in 1978. She is now living happily at the age of 69. In this room, we are familiar with the target. You've been there on the ground? No, but we've been over it many times. And since we'll be making free flight jumps... ...you on camera again. Well, I don't know the answer to that question. Um, the last uh, TV thing I did was an episode of a show called Chase. Jane Seymour was born on February 15, 1951, in Uxbridge, United Kingdom. She played the character Serena in the TV series when she was 27 years old in 1978. She is now living happily at the age of 72. We were. Oh, I'm sorry. You'd rather not be involved. Hey, don't be silly. It's a warrior to do. Um, compo composer, which he was. So, um, Laurie and I were friends, and I made this movie, and I said, Laurie, I have just made a movie that is screaming. Marion Jensen was born on September 23, 1956, in Arcadia, California, USA. She played the character Lieutenant Athena in the TV series when she was 22 years old in 1978. She is currently living happily at the age of 66. Let's hope so. Of course it won't change anything when he gets back. I wouldn't want it any other way. George Murdoch was born on June 25, 1930 in Salina, Kansas, USA. He portrayed the character Dr. Salik in the TV series when he was 48 years old in 1978. We regret to inform you that in 2012, he passed away at the age of 81, leaving us deeply saddened. I know you are. Yeah, that's the problem. <coughs> Let's get down to the filth. Terry Carter was born on December 16, 1928, in Brooklyn, New York, USA. He played the character Colonel Ty in the TV series when he was 50 years old in 1978. He is currently living happily at the age of 94. Energizer to trade for new seats. Well, then what's the problem? We have energizers all over this Battlestar. They run everything we have. But they have colonial markings all over them. What we Let me know who's your favorite character from the TV series Original Battlestar Galactica and share your thoughts on the deceased actors by leaving your comments under this video. Remember to support us by liking, subscribing to the channel, and pressing the bell to receive my upcoming videos. Thank you and see you again.